Okay, so this is like, I guess it's a vent, but have you ever had someone, and this is for people who are natural, because obviously if you're not natural, you wouldn't have had anybody to ask you the question I'm about to say or make this statement. But have you ever had somebody, you're talking to somebody and they go, oh, that looks good on you. Not everybody can do that. I don't understand that because how can you say not everybody can wear the hair that grows out of their scalp the same texture it is when they're born? That's what you really look like. And they go, oh, your hair is nappy. Your hair is nappy too. You just got you just relaxed your nappy hair. I just wear my hair as it is as opposed to relaxing my naps as you have. Your hair is nappy too. And to know that looks good on you. Everybody can't do that. Wait, we, we, you trying to say people can't be who they are and look how they naturally look? Everybody can't do that. Everybody can do that. And yes, I know some people prefer to wear their hair straight. And that's fine. I don't have a problem with that. I have straightened my hair before. But it's those people that will kind of look at, look, mm, she got nappy hair. Or, mm, I would never wear my hair like that. Why? Why would you never wear your hair like this? Because you can't accept the way you really look. Or is it just because you prefer straight hair? Because if it's just because you prefer straight hair, that's fine. But if it's because you have a problem with kinky hair, then you need to check yourself. I just had to say that. And somebody's probably going to be offended by this video and leave a rude comment like, Oh my goodness, she's so against relaxers. And I'm not against straight hair. I don't like relaxers. I have to be honest. I do have a problem with relaxers. And I just feel like anything you're putting on your pores, your scalp is a pore. Stuff, your scalp absorbs things. Because you're putting this harsh chemical on your scalp, I feel like that eventually it will affect your health. I do. And uh, they're still doing research on it, but people are developing Alzheimer's from working in salons around permanent hair dye and relaxers constantly. And there are a lot of health problems that I think black women are developing mentally, I think because, in part, because of relaxers. I really do. Maybe I'm a conspiracy theorist, and I feel like the man is trying to get us with the relaxer. But that's how I feel. That's how I feel. I'm just being honest. You can say what you want. You can be mean and write anything you want to write on the comments. That's cool, but this is how I feel. So, yeah, I don't like when people say that. Oh, that, I could never wear my hair like that. That looks good on you. Everybody can't wear their hair like that. Whatever. It's fine. And so, I mean, I guess you could say everybody can't wear their hair in a mohawk. That doesn't look good on everybody. But if it is what you were meant to look like, if it's what grows out of your scalp, if it's your hair texture, then how can you say everybody can't wear their hair like that? I'm just wearing it how God made it, how it grew from my scalp. Like that is of no consequence because this is what my hair really looks like. Whatever. It's nappy. I like it. Holds a curl better when it's nappy. So, you know, whatever. But that's how I feel. And I'm a little bit of a conspiracy theorist about the relaxers as it is anyway I just don't see the benefit and I feel like you can straighten your hair without having a relaxer if you like straight hair straighten your hair but you don't have to relax it and the thing that really like grinds my gears I feel like family guy the thing that really grinds my gears is the fact that you go and you relax your hair and you put a weave on top of it what was the point in relaxing your hair if you're not gonna wear it out anyway just just get some straight weave if you want to wear a straight weave. Why you got to relax the hair under the straight weave? I don't understand. Ugh, I sound like a man right now. I'm just confused about some things. I had to get it off my chest. You know, I just had to say that. I don't have anything else to say. If you're offended, I was about to say I apologize, but I don't because, I mean, whatever. You're offended. Don't be offended. It's just one woman's opinion. There are thousands of others that disagree with me. So, that's all I have to say. Alright. I'm done. Seriously. For real. Not for fake, but for real. On, on the real tip. Okay, bye. Seriously. Okay. Alright. Okay. 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 Bye. Please hang up and try again.